So there you go. Next is the web page design. This one says, all right, so they have questions about web page design. Remember, this is new to the syllabus. If for people who did, who, did, who did their SBA, they have to actually build a web page. But for people who write in the exam privately, which will be the people who write in Jan exams in the next two weeks, they're going to have to do um, answer questions about a web page. So in a web page design, what is going to happen? Amory created a website for a small photography business and was eager to have it published. However, he was told that he should consider um, completing checks before doing so. Insert first, second, and third in the following table to indicate the order in which the activities must be completed. All right, so let's see. Maintain the website, definitely not first. Maintain the website is clearly third. There's no question about that because you could only maintain something after it's built. So between test the audience and verify that the hyperlinks work correctly, or use a test audience. I think that you should verify that all the hyperlinks work correctly and then use a test audience to tell you how they feel about it because verifying all the hyperlinks working correctly is definitely something that you have to do as the developer. So that will go there. And then second, you'll test it on somebody to see if they like it and whatnot. And then once it's tested, you could put it into um, practice and then maintain it. All right, now what is this? Give one example of a hyperlink that could be used on the web page. An example of a hyperlink that will be used on the web page will be um, an email link, which it could be amoryphotos at gmail.com. Um, so basically what they want is for you to give an example of a hyperlink and what it would do. So that's, that's, that's cool. That's logical. I see no problems there. So basically what you have to say is, um, emaryphotos at gmail.com to contact him, right? Cause it says, give one example and then explain its purpose. So we give an example, which is put in his email address and then we say in what we want to do to contact him. So that's, that's, that's logical, right? So that's a nice question there. 